Hello friends, today I'm going to read those can-do pigs. This book has some rhyming words in it, so let's see if we can find them. It's written by David McPhail. In the morning, in the morning bright and early, can-do pigs are gruff and surly. Till they've had their toast and tea, then they're happy as can be. Before a can-do pig steps out, he takes a bath and scrubs out his snout. He shines his shoes and ties his tie, then he gives a mo his mom a kiss goodbye. Can-do pigs can take a ride up and down the countryside. They stop at Vern's to change a tire and fix the fan belt with some wire. Did you hear some rhyming words? Wire and tire. When can-do pigs are building roads, they get some help from frogs and toads. They rake the dirt and hose it down. Then I'll jump in and roll around. Those can-do pigs can do repairs, mending tables, lamps, and chairs. They try to make them good as new with the hammer nails and glue. Those can-do pigs, they can do most anything. Have you ever heard, heard them sing, or play piano with a stick, or beat them bongos with a brick? A can-do pig could a can-do pig could can-can well until the day she stripped and fell. Down the stairs and out the door, she doesn't can-can anymore. Uh-oh. In the summer when it's hot, can-do pigs don't do a lot. They rub themselves with suntan lotion, then jump into the salty ocean. Can-do pigs in pink pajamas can row a boat to the Bahamas. If a hungry shark attacks, those piggies give them 40 whacks. In the grass down by the shore, a can-do pig disturbs a boa. That's a snake. The snake wakes up and starts to hiss. Then gives the pig a great big kiss. Can-do pigs can never lie. They just can't. I don't know why. George Washington pig chopped down a tree. Then he told his father it was me. Can-do pigs climb up trees. They hang from branches by their knees. Don't worry if you see them fall. They'll bounce right back. Boing! Like a ball. Those pigs can fly. Did you know that? Just like a bee, a bird, a bat, you can see them in the sky. Watch out, duck. One just flew by. From the closet, down the hall, steps a pig who's very small. He smiles and asks, how do you do? Quite well, I say, but who are you? I'm super duper can-do pig, and though it's true, I'm not that big. There's not a thing that I can't do. Just watch, I can clean your house for you. Oh, I wish this pig would come to my house. He lifts me up into the air, then he mops beneath my chair. Next we fly around the room while he sweeps it with a broom. He cleans each cranny, every nook. He blows the dust off every book. And when he's done, he flies away. I'll be back, he calls someday. Pigs can rocket to the moon. They leave at 10, arrive by noon. They stop for lunch. Out there in space, the cat is getting closer. 
you hear? Do you hear? At some little fast food place. Wait, they stopped for lunch. Wait, hold on. This cat is very close. It's not my cat. They stopped for lunch out there in space. At some point, little fast food place. Kitty. At the rodeo, can-do's rule. Dress in outfits that are cool. They can ride those bulls so well. I have never heard one of them, one that fell. Can-do piggies can't stand war. They stomp their feet and shout, no more. <laughs> they put the generals in a pile. Then they tickle them for a while. In the winter when it snows and that chilly north wind blows, those pigs can build a giant hog. For the nose, they use a log. Those pigs can coast down any hill. The steepest gives them the biggest thrill. And if some piggies don't have sleds, they don't mind, they use their beds. It's your birthday, what, no cake? Someone's made a big mistake. I hear a ruckus. Okay. Ask those pigs to bake one quick. What, white or chocolate, take your pick. Do your cellar stairs go creak? Perhaps you'd better take a peek, but bring along a can-do pig. Make sure you find one that is big. If the kitty's still here when I'm done, I'll show you a picture of the kitty. Can-do pigs are quite amazing. I've seen them late at night stargazing, stretched out on their <laughs> on their brisky backs, munching on their midnight snacks. Lying there beside the lake, those piggies still awake. I listen closely, not one peep. Those can-do pigs are sound asleep. It's good to have a can-do friend to stand beside you till the end. No matter where, no matter when, it's good to have a can-do friend. What was your favorite part of the book? Oh, the kitty. The kitty. Should we see the kitty? Let's see the kitty. Kitty! Wait, how do I make the camera flip?